here's another way to pop air bubbles and resin without using heat. So if you can't get your hands on denatured alcohol, you can also use isopropyl alcohol and it does the same thing to break up the surface tension and pop the bubbles. Just make sure you're using 90% or above to get the same effect. I also wouldn't use this trick on the final coat of tabletop epoxy because it can leave these little dimples in the surface. I feel like I get the best top coat results with a heat gun torch kind of combo, but everyone has their own preferences, so just do whatever works best for you, I guess. 